Chris, thanks. Hurricane Ian now just hours away from making landfall in Florida. This is a major hurricane where every part of the storm will have major impacts. But Chris tells us there is one part called the dirty side of the hurricane. He explains in this week's Weather IQ. Hurricanes can devastate coastal areas with epic winds, dangerous storm surge, and even spawn multiple tornadoes. But one side of the storm is worse than any other. It's called the dirty part of the storm. Let's raise that weather IQ. Hurricanes rotate like this, counterclockwise. And when that rotation of the storm matches with the direction that it's moving, it enhances the winds. For example, a hurricane producing 100 mile per hour winds moving north at 20 miles per hour would have a max wind speed of 120 miles per hour on the right side since you add those numbers together. But on the left side, the winds are fighting against its forward push. So the forward speed is subtracted, making the total winds 80 miles per hour. That's a big difference. All sides of a hurricane or tropical storm are dangerous, but the strongest side of a hurricane is the right side based on the direction it's moving, AKA the dirty side. We call this the dirty side because this is where the worst weather occurs. This is also the part of the hurricane that has the worst storm surge along the coast, among other things. Using Hurricane Ian as an example, the worst storm surge would occur here, where the counterclockwise winds are pushing water on shore. The faster the storm is blowing and moving, the higher the storm surge. The dirty side also has the most moisture, leading to the heaviest rainfall rates, and has the most wind shear, which makes tornadoes and water spots more likely, especially in that right front quadrant. With WCNC Charlotte, I'm meteorologist Chris Mulcahy.